Oh, hi guys and welcome back to uh, this video in this section and today we're going to be adding a 360 video to our scenes and how we're going to do this is we're going to make a Sophia and we are going to put the Sophia on us uh, when we load up our app but we are also going to be able to walk outside of the Sophia see the outside and then walk into it like we are walking into a portal as so so let's dive in this is going to be dope so what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy this code and drag it down just a little bit and paste it in here and what I'm going to do is so we don't get any problems from Xcode just gonna do this here and do this here right so in my folders over here we have now added a 360 video and basically where we add video last time it's just gonna go right here 360 I'm gonna keep that the same um, and then where we've created a plane in the last one and we're just going to take this down and we are going to say SCN sphere and then we're just going to give this a radius of about 12 should be good for now um, no, about 2, sorry should be good for now we don't want to be massive um, and this is good but the only problem with this is we as it is right now the video would be upside down so if we walked into it the floor would be above us and obviously the sky would be on our feet so we need to flip this so we need to change the contents of the transform in the diffuse so this is about this is one line of code and it's really easy so we're going to go uh, tv geo dot first material uh, diffuse dot contents transform and this is going to be equal to scm matrix 4 translate and then we are also going to add a SCN matrix for make scale. This is what we need. This is what we need to focus on. So we're going to say minus one, one, and one. And we're going to move out of here. And this is going to be one, one, and one. In fact, no, it isn't. It's going to be zero and zero my bad it would be all over the place if it was that so don't do that zero zero um and this is basically all we need so let's run this and see what happens So there you have it guys, that's adding and playing 360 video inside ARKit and I hope you've enjoyed this uh, video today and I'll see you guys in the next section.